Hello everyone, welcome to the Bug Expert channel. In this video we will provide information on how to fix Valorant Error Code VAL62. Valorant Error Code 62 is usually received during system timeout. This error code 62 occurs mostly during server maintenance and server related issues. For this, we will try to solve the problem by telling you a few suggestions. You may encounter VAL62 error due to unstable network connection in Valorant. To fix the unstable network connection problem, you can first reboot the modem. To do this, press the power button on the back of your modem and turn it off. After 20 to 30 seconds, turn on the modem by pressing the power button again. After connecting to the internet, run Valorant and check if the issue persists. One of the reasons for unstable network connection is internet access via Wi-Fi network. If you are accessing the internet with a Wi-Fi network, you can check if the issue persists by establishing a wired connection. We can avoid connection request problems by using the default Google DNS server. Type control panel in the start search screen and open it. Click on the network and internet category title. Then click on the network and sharing center heading. Then define the DNS address by following the steps I showed in the video. After the process is complete, if the Internet Protocol version 6 option is active, disable it and save it by pressing the OK button. After this process, type CMD in the Start Search screen and run it as an administrator. Paste the codes in the article in the command prompt window that opens and press Enter. After the process is complete, you can restart the computer and check if the problem persists. We can disable security scanning by adding Valorant and Riot Vanguard folders as exceptions via Windows Defender. This is because Windows Defender may scan the Valorant and Riot Vanguard folder, causing the client to crash or block. For this, we can add Valorant and Riot Vanguard folder as exceptions and prevent security scanning. Type Virus and Threat Protection in the Start Search screen and open it. On the screen that opens, click on Manage Settings. Then scroll down the menu and click on Add or Remove Exceptions. On the screen that opens, click Add Exception and then Folder. In the new window that opens, we will need to select the Riot Games and Riot Vanguard folders. Usually these folders are located in the location we showed in the video. After selecting and saving the folders in order, you can run Valorant and check if the problem persists. First, we added the Riot client folder as an exception via Windows Defender. Now we're going to do a clean install of Riot Vanguard. Type services in the start search screen and open it. In the new window that opens, find the VGC service and right click on it and click stop. After performing this operation, let's delete Riot Vanguard. In the start search screen, type add or remove programs and open it. Then type Riot Vanguard in the search screen and select it. Then click uninstall. A warning message will appear. Let's proceed by saying yes to the warning message. After the uninstall process is complete, run the Riot client and select Valorant. Click the update button and wait for Riot Vanguard to install. After successfully installing Riot Vanguard, restart the computer. After the computer boots up, type services in the start search screen and open it. Find the VGC service in the new window that opens and double click on it to open it. Then start the service status by setting the startup type option to automatic. If you encounter an error while starting the service, you can eliminate the problem by accessing the video we left on the card above. After the process is complete, press the apply button to save the settings. After this process, run Valorant and check if the issue persists. We can eliminate the problem by clearing the Riot Client Logs files. This is because the previous incorrect upload of Riot Client Logs files may not allow some Logs files to be loaded, leading to potential errors. For this, you can eliminate the problem by clearing the Riot Client Logs files. First of all, close Riot Client with the help of Task Manager. 
Type run in the start search screen and open it. Type the file directory in the article in the box on the screen that opens. Press enter and open. Then delete all the folders in the folder. After the folders are deleted, run Riot Client and check. Some files may need to run as administrator. For this, you can eliminate the problem by running the Riot Client as an administrator. Right click the Riot Client application on your desktop and click Run as Administrator. Then check if the problem persists. Maintenance work on Valorant servers may cause you to encounter various error codes like these. In addition, the crashing problem on the servers will cause you to encounter such errors. For this, we can observe what is causing the problem by checking the Riot servers. You can check the Riot and Valorant servers by accessing the link in the article. If there is maintenance work on the server, you will have to wait for it to be fixed. Yes, in this video we have provided information on how to fix Valorant error code VAL62. If the problem persists, you can comment.